All right, Michelle from Good Day State Line here with us this morning, giving us a new photo challenge that's taking over the internet. So uh, no one really knows where this came from, apparently, right? Nope. Yeah. But it's super fun, and those are the best things anyway. I mean, does yeah. it really matter where it came from? No. No, yeah. it does not. So this is, I saw this yesterday, and I wanted to share it with you, because it's the perfect thing for a Friday, too. Um, taking over Twitter and Instagram, it's going to make you laugh, it's going to make you smile, and we need that now more than any time. So it's called the unflattering dog photo challenge. So people are posting these photos. Here's the deal. You take pictures of your dog, right? All the time. Whitney, you have a dog. You take tons of pictures yeah, of your dog. Yeah, actually just looking at so, a couple of them. So, yeah, you, you know, you're getting that perfect picture and that's the one you end up posting like, oh, my dog's in a Halloween costume or waiting for Santa, you know, whatever. Cute picture. But you have a lot of outtakes on your phone probably too. So that's what this challenge is all about, the outtakes. Uh, so I sent a bunch of photos to our director and told him to pick his favorites actually so that's what we're looking <laughs> at never right do now. that never do that i no, love this kidding. one this dog i mean if you look at it what like if you have to kind of even move your head to see what this dog looks like because at first looking straight up and down i thought this dog was maybe like a small dog and then if you turn to the side you can see its ears going up and down totally no idea what this dog looks I like can't. when it's not yeah. shaking water off so we have another one to show you <laughs> this is upside like down my dog. <laughs> yes totally so this is a good one i know joey's over there laughing too he's got two dogs i bet you he has some unflattering dog photos he can show us Millions. on instagram uh later today so we have a couple more to show you here um that one actually <laughs> you really got to make sure you know like that's upside down i know that's what my dog looks like okay so this Aww. one is one of my favorites i saw this one online too he just looks scared right he looks terrified he almost looks like he's a human in a dog costume he does he's really <laughs> cute though i know these are so much fun um there's also an unflattering cat photo challenge but i just think it's not as popular as the unflattering dog photo i'm just gonna yeah. put it out there i looked at the hashtags there's way more dog photos trending on instagram i think we have a couple more to look at um, this, <laughs> That's a good this one. dog, okay, so this is amazing. This is not only that is unflattering. This that is, is very a, flattering. I think. <laughs> this is the most incredible dog photo ever taken. This dog is playing frisbee. <laughs> this is a, this one you framed. This is not unflattering. I love like karate this. kid. Yeah, I mean, and how many pictures do you think this dog owner has of the like mid frisbee catch? It's like a one in a million shot. Yeah, that's awesome. I think we have one more. <laughs> I told funny. our director to pick five of his favorites. All right, let's see. Oh, oh here's yeah. the last one. This is going to the when the wind hits the dog like that, it is rather unflattering for the dog, but entertaining <laughs> for the rest of us. I think this is so much fun too because if you were going to do this with humans, like your unflattering like boyfriend pictures or unflattering kids pictures, they probably wouldn't appreciate it. And your dogs are still going to love you anyway. <laughs> okay, so we want to see them too. So yeah. we'll, we'll check the, the hashtag for anybody local. All right, thanks, Michelle. Michelle, of course, also uh, previewing everything happening at Good Day State Line. So stay with us here on Fox 39. Okay, we want to go to our Morning Mud Club question of the day. We ask you a question every day on our Facebook page, but it's National Bosses Day. What is your favorite thing about your boss? Let's see some of your responses right here on Eyewitness News. 